Vitamin K2 is a fat soluble vitamin, which means it's better absorbed in the presence of dietary fats. Consuming vitamin K2 rich foods with healthy fats can improve absorption. So you can consume olive oil, avocado, nuts and seeds, dark chocolate, coconut oil, fatty fish like salmon, mackerel, sardines. These are high in omega-3 fats, full fat yogurts. Remember that moderation is key as these fats are calorie dense. A well-balanced diet that includes a variety of nutrient-dense foods and good fats can help optimize the absorption and utilization of vitamin K2, promoting overall health and well-being. And now we will talk about the difference between vitamin K1 and vitamin K2 briefly. Vitamin K1 mainly involved in blood clotting, while K2 is primarily associated with bone health and cardiovascular support. Vitamin K1 predominantly found in green leafy vegetables and plant oils, whereas vitamin K2 is more abundant in animal-based foods and fermented products. Let's talk about potential harms. Vitamin K2 is generally considered safe when consumed from food sources. However, excessive supplementation without proper medical guidance may lead to potential harms such as Vitamin K plays a role in blood clotting, so high doses of vitamin K2 can interfere with anticoagulant medications like warfarin if you are using them. If you are on blood thinning medications, it's essential to consult your healthcare professional before taking any vitamin K supplements. Some people may be sensitive or allergic to certain vitamin K2 rich foods like natto or dairy products. Allergic reactions could range from mild to severe and require medical attention. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to watch our vitamin B2 benefits, vitamin C excess symptoms, folate deficiency signs videos, and see you on the next one.